students at Iowa School for the Deaf will be able to enjoy playtime outside even more. The school has a new playground as of November 21st, where kids can now have fun without the restrictions they had before. A new place for kids to play. <laughs> Iowa School for the Deaf opens its new playground for elementary students November 21st. Our entire school showed up and we had some little kids participate in this ceremony to thank our donors. Five organizations donated money to build a special playground. It's about a $180,000 project all made possible through private funds. Iowa School for the Deaf designed the new equipment with several considerations for its students. We have some blind deaf children now, so they really need to, to feel the ground, to feel the grass, to feel the different transitions as they walk around the playground to help them know where they are. And with nearly half of the students wearing hearing devices, the new play area is safer. This playground is made with less plastic because the static electricity it would create could cause damage to the cochlear implants the students wear. <laughs> to avoid that happening in the past, we had our children take off the cochlear implants or take off their hearing aids, and then they had no access to that sound and language on the playground. Instead of pea gravel, where hearing devices are easily lost, the new surface is flat and soft so even disabled children can explore. We also use some colors in the playground that our children with low vision could detect some certain blues and yellows so they could appreciate some different colors outside. The different features even help students challenge themselves and gain independence. We have some equipment where they can reach and build their upper arm strength, which we didn't have before either. We have many children who have balance issues and there's some different stepping stones that they're going to be able to be on. It's really going to challenge them. School officials say it's a safe risk for students with the soft surfacing. We knew that we were going to need this playground because the needs of our children changed when they've got the cochlear implants and we're seeing so many more special needs children now that need different equipment on the playground. Iowa School for the Deaf started plans for the playground three years ago. A new playground for preschool kids also opened in the fall of last year.